are on our way to, um, where are we going? <laughs> Costco, duh. <laughs> so today, first of all, is really nice outside. And I know I'm starting to say that more often um, because the weather is really nice. Today is only going to be 83. And I wished with all my heart that the day would only be 83. Or I mean, like the whole year could be like around this temperature instead of hitting those extreme heat waves, which is going to be Thursday at like 90. Ugh, gross. Nonetheless, uh, we're on our way to Costco because I want to take advantage of the really nice weather. And Charlie needs diapers. So his dad sent me the money because, uh, oh my God, diapers are expensive. <laughs> I do not envy them for having to purchase diapers. And speaking of that, Charlie decided yesterday to take his diaper off. And uh, what a little brat. <laughs> um, I think he might be getting ready to potty train because he, apparently when he pees, he's now starting to take his diaper off. Um, and then he pooped and took the diaper off. Yeah. So thankfully we caught him in time and uh, I got him into the bathtub because that could have been a complete disaster that would have been obnoxious and really, really gross. Um, Smokey looked at me like, oh, he's allowed to poop in the house, but I'm not. <laughs> oh my God, I cannot believe that happened. But yep so we're gonna go into costco i have to um i'm gonna get some lamb meat and make heroes or gyros or gyros however you want to say it um probably not tonight but tomorrow and costco sells a package actually it's like a a package but it has two packages inside of the meat already processed already ready to go um, and so you just heat it up in the skillet. It's super, super easy and really, really good. So, so I don't usually shop Costco very much. You guys know I don't like to go out in the heat. And to me, the Costco parking is so frustrating. Um, I just feel like it's insane. <laughs> and I don't like to do it in the heat of the summer. And so since today is going to be pretty nice and it's, and I'm still wearing a sweatshirt, then I figured I'm going to run into Costco, grab those diapers. Um, I'm going to grab some uh, lamb for gyros or gyros or heroes, however you want to say it, um, for dinner, either tonight or tomorrow. And uh, they actually have a really good deal. And then I'm going to go ahead and get coffee because Dottie and I drink a lot of coffee. And I was going to order coffee from Fry's yesterday, and it is like $8.99 for the little, uh, the big size they sell at Fry's, and it's a Fry's Kroger brand, but Costco, I believe, sells the Folgers, which is the big thing, for like $12 instead of the $8.99, you know, so it's just a better deal. I, I don't like to do math, and I don't really do it well, but I do know a good deal. <laughs> so, and so my friend shops Costco all the time and she's, she's so fun. She's single. Um, <laughs> and she's very, um, like driven to try many different diets all the time. So she'll go out and she'll buy something that pertains to that specific diet. And then she'll call me in like a month and be like, I have a bunch of food I don't want. And so I'll go grab it. Um, typically, it's going to be like snack type items. Like, um, what are those? Hot Pockets? Uh, yeah, I know Hot Pockets can be good, I guess. I don't really like them, but Ben likes them. So she got these... Um, like chicken bake style things that Costco makes and freezes. Um, and Ben really likes those. And so <laughs> I'm so thankful though, because, you know, I mean, it's a way to feed Ben and, uh, 
he likes a lot of the little things that she ends up sending over. There's like burritos one time and just all kinds of things. And she's so funny because she'll be like, take this for Ben. He needs this, you know, um, mostly because she knows that we don't really eat a lot of things like that. Um, last night, actually, we had a treat. I um, decided to get a thing of strawberries and I don't know, but these strawberries that showed up are pretty lame. <laughs> Um, I did give Charlie a couple of them and then I thought, you know, I really need to use these because I think they're going to rot and I just got them. So I got blueberries and I went ahead and made like a little dessert where I had a little bit of, um, whipped cream or cool whip, the kind in the can. I don't know which is which, but I, uh, sprayed a little in there and then put like cut up some strawberries and blueberries and Donnie is not a big one for fruit at all um but I just made a tiny little bowl full of it um for me him and and Ben was thrilled I mean he was just like you know it's just stuff we don't normally eat and so I felt really fancy um having such a, a cool little delicious treat at the end of the day <laughs> so that was our big weekend uh fanciness I guess um it was May the 4th and oh my god Donnie never gets sick I mean he gets an allergy situation once in a while and he's had a cold before but he's not normally one to get very ill and he got really sick yesterday and was basically in bed almost the whole day like when Charlie took his nap Donnie took a nap and I felt really bad for him because you know it sucks to be sick in general but I wanted to go <laughs> I wanted to go to on the rocks because it was Cinco de Mayo and they had tacos a, a taco trio plate which was like three different types of tacos which is not just your regular like mom's tacos these were like sincerely wonderful looking tacos <laughs> And I was so excited for that. And then we didn't go because Donnie felt sick, which was fine. I mean, I totally get it. I totally understand. And, you know, such is life. Also, our huge Star Wars fans. And so we definitely watched a lot of Star Wars. Like, hours of Star Wars. Which I'll do again. Because it's just a Monday. It doesn't have to be May the 4th. Um... And I also have exciting news. Carmelita's going to come visit. She's going to be here, her and Gus. Sean can't come because he's working, but she and Gus will be here um, the end of the month. So be ready for those videos because I am so excited to see him. Um, I have made it a habit to FaceTime on Sundays because I have Charlie and that way Charlie and Gus can see each other and they kind of look at each other, but they don't really interact. Um, Although I did get Gus to blow me a kiss and I did get Gus to, I think he recognizes me. And again, he's two months older than Charlie, but that makes a big difference in development. Um, he's just so dang cute. Both boys are. I wonder if he takes his diaper off. I hope not. <laughs> All right. I got to run in. Talk to you later. Bye-bye. Okay. I was in and out. <laughs> I think it took maybe 12 minutes fantastic. So I did get the coffee and my lamb meat was $8.99. They put it on sale, but I think it used to be $9.99 and now they're upping it to $11. I bet you. Sorry, I'm out of breath because I was hurrying. Um, I was I'm trying to think because the sale item said, or the sale was $8.99 from 11 and I thought it was not 11 before Ugh, I tell you everything's going up but I did score something really cool Ugh, I'm so excited this is organic blue agave now I need that for a couple of recipes that I wanted to try and it specifically asked for agave even though it said I could substitute with honey oh honey in general is expensive and I want to say the big bottle at Costco is like 
which I did not want to spend. Um, but this was $8.99 for both bottles. The fact that it's blue agave is exciting because that's a really good deal for one bottle. I just purchased a bottle of just regular honey, I believe, smaller than that for about $6.99 or $7.99, something like that, at Fry's. Now, granted, at Fry's I do get the points, but this is such a great deal. So I'm excited that I got that. That made this whole thing worth it. Um, I did get the diapers and the Costco on cold at least has really, I should say Grant, um, the Grant location has shifted <laughs> where all the waters were before. Now it's all diapers. In fact, I was like, where are the diapers? <laughs> and so then, um, I don't know. I don't know what they're doing. They're just rearranging everything. Um, and I do have to say I was very tempted to get some cinnamon rolls or something sweet because it smelled delicious in there. Um, I want to say that maybe right here is also where the end of the bakery is or something because it smells divine. But I was not tempted and I did not get anything. Um, so anyways, I'm on my way, headed back home. Talk to you soon. Drink your water. Bye-bye.